Well, Shape Center, of course, you know, is an institution, uh, not only in Houston, you know, but particularly in the Third War community. I think having the mural uh, placed here, particularly in a high visibility area in the park, uh, is kind of intrinsic with the, the whole aspect of people and the community, and particularly having access to it. I'm Israel McLeod, and I'm a visual artist uh, and uh, creative artist here in Houston, Texas. The best name from, from my own perspective as an artist would be uh, Generational Seasons. And the reason I'm entitling it Generational Seasons, one of the things that the executive director, uh, Mr. Deloitte Parker, wanted to emphasize was the three different generations, elderhood, uh, particularly the family unit, and youth. I certainly wanted it to be something, again, that um, spoke to community, family, and as always in my theme, humanity. Uh, even though it is an African-American family, it still does not mean that it is limited to that particular, you know, uh, community. Uh, the birds, of course, symbolize, and have always, I use the birds in a lot of my work, and that symbolizes humanity and hope and all things uh, positive, high, and elevated. I really wanted to put emphasis on elderhood, the importance of it, the nobility of seniority and wisdom and knowledge, and how that transcends, you know, the generations. But particularly with this one, I did want it to be something that was not only message-oriented, but I wanted it to be visually attractive as well. And hats off to Chenier. Uh, I, I think it's a wonderful thing when we have major corporations uh, such as them that have that level of uh, insight and they are in touch with the needs of the community and want to extend uh, their awareness of that, you know, beyond the point of awareness, but also putting their money where their mouth is. Always emphasizing the importance and the need for public art, um, raising the awareness of the community to the uh, connectedness of the visual arts uh, with the community, just utilizing our palette and our creative menu to be able to speak the, the, um, the needs and the sentiment and sometimes the emotions of those people who may or may not have that particular mechanism of creativity and expression themselves. So I'm thankful for the opportunity to do that yet again.